welcome to another episode of Checkout Basket. Today, we're checking out a lunchtime special from Red Rooster. Now, $5 goes a little way, but this one costs $5.99, so just under, under $6. So it's still in the $5 range, and it is loaded chips with chicken. Nice of them, they give you a, a knife, fork, and a serve mariette. A wet towelette to clean your face and your hands after you finish eating this, because it's supposed to be a little bit messy. And a nice foil container. Let's find out what's in here. It's a decent size as well, it's not small. Alright, here's a reveal. So, you get chicken. Shredded chicken, their gravy, which I love their gravy. Their gravy is, it's not like, it's not like the KFC gravy. This is like different type of gravy altogether. It's a chicken, it is a chicken gravy, but it's nice. And chips, all covered up. All right, I'm gonna dish half of this up for my offsider who sits off camera to help you and me find out if this thing tastes good or not. Taste test time. All right, so in front of you, you have half of, of my, uh, of what I've got here. So you've got actually half in front of you of the loaded chicken chips or fries from Red Rooster. Now there's gravy in there, there's shredded chicken, um, and chips in a quite a large pack. And th this is, this is half. That's half. That's not bad for, what is it, $5.99? $5.99. 5.99. Yep, I paid 5.99 because I paid on FPOS and they round it to the, they, they leave it at the right cents. And they give you a little knife and fork and a wet towelette and stuff as well. Yeah, that's not bad, is it? That's, that's, a, that's a good value meal. Yep. Now, I was trying to get there. They used to have a $5 quarter chicken and chips. A quarter of chicken. Really? But they don't have that anymore. I don't know why. They're not doing quarters of chicken with chips for five bucks for lunch anymore. But look, this was the, their, 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 their second cheapest lunch item. Or their, their next cheapest lunch item that I could see that I had. And this is what the guy recommended. And it's a lot. I'm, I'm going to be stonked after this. Alright, shall we go in for a taste? Taste test. Well, I'm going to get some of the chicken by itself. Yeah. With the gravy. So I like to see how fresh their chicken is. Their gravy's not as hot as the gravy. Chicken's not dry, but it's moist. It's nice, isn't it? It's not dried out. The gravy is awesome. Mm. The chips are alright too. But especially like the when chicken. they're smothered when they're smothered in the gravy. Okay. Alright, let's get a bit of everything. And we'll give that a rate. Mmm. Alright. I'm ready to give this thing a rating. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so what are you going to give it? Out of five. I'm giving it a five out of five. That's good value. Yeah, look. For value for money, for that size, I... This this could easily feed two people. Not just one. And I've got half of this, you've got half of this, and it's feeding both of us. Well, I'm a big person, and I'm finding this is good. This, this is, is good this value. is a nice amount. Um, alright, so you're giving it a five. Yes. Right, look, I'm... Uh, I'm going to give it a four, only because it doesn't no have a drink. Oh, no drink. It doesn't have a drink. I mean, you've got to still go yeah, get your drink, yeah, yeah. and that would bring the price up to about $8 something. Oh. If you, so, and they don't do fountain drinks either. They're all bottled or canned at Red Rooster. So, yeah, for me, it's a four. You're giving it a five. That's a nine out of ten, people. This is a great value. Just remember, if you've seen anything you like in these videos, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget any comments, questions, or things I could be doing better in these videos. Leave it in the comments down below. Maybe you've had these before, and you've added things to it. Because I know you can add bacon, and I know you can add cheese to these. To make it even more of a gourmet, loaded fries. That would be just like a Putin if you put cheese on it. That's right. So tell me about it. Tell me if you've had these before. Tell me in the comments field below. And if you haven't hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Get notified when I do these. Check out Basket Episodes, my daily vlogs, Urban Explorer, Cooking with Craig, Car Maintenance, you name it. 
I film it, it ends up on YouTube. So, hit that subscribe button. And until next time, see you in the next video. Yeah, I reckon, I reckon adding the, the other parts to this, the cheese and the bacon, would, would just make this over-the-top gourmet.